Hello, my name is Jamin. I'm the technician with Luxury Auto Works diagnosing your vehicle today. So I have my diagnostic equipment connected to the engine module here. We'll pull that up right quick. So we do have a couple faults stored, which I do believe you might have been aware of. So that's uh, that P2017-1. And that is going to be self-adaptation of mixture formation for right bank of cylinders is at limit value. And then the other one is going to be P2086-1. Same thing, it's just gonna be for the left cylinder bank as you can see there. So basically what's happening is your air fuel mixture is not correct. Um, and that's what's setting that fault. So I'm gonna kind of bring the phone over here, or the, the camera here. I don't know if you'll be able to hear that kind of hissing sound. It's gonna be coming from this component right here. So basically as you can see here how that valve cover is deteriorated. Um, so there's basically just a vacuum leak has been created right there at that connection point for that vent line. Um, and it's just sucking in air because of that, you know, the valve cover failure. Um, so for that issue, I'm gonna suggest replacement of the valve cover itself, um, as well as these vent lines that are connected here. Basically, you know, they're rubber lines that are gonna become brittle. You know, once we remove them, there's a very good chance they're gonna break. So anytime we perform that valve cover repair, we always replace those vent lines. Um, you know, one other thing I did put on there was spark plugs, just, you know, for no additional labor, just out of the, the uh, cost of the part. If we're gonna be in that area anyway, you know, we might as well replace those spark plugs while we're there. Um, one other thing I did want to make you aware of, I did notice you had that active brake warning on the dash. Um, so the warning was for the pressure reservoir of the SBC module. Um, so that is actually a covered repair at a uh, Mercedes. I would, so I would suggest, uh, you know, get with Mercedes and verifying that that is covered on your vehicle, but that should be a covered repair that would be replaced at no cost to you.